Who is this guy that we're controlling now? Let's go forward. I don't know what's happening right now. Lauren Winter. Ring any bells? Nope. Can't say it does. Mm-hmm. Uh... Been looking for weeks. Hope I hit pay dirt this time. Guess I better take the stairs. What's this? Oh. Oh, that Lauren Winter. Money. Third floor, last door on the left at the end of the corridor. All right, let's go. Stairs. Wait. Oh, I was trying to see if we were just thinking anything, but yeah. I guess we're not thinking anything, so right, it's not that door, it's this door. Nope. Look at the scratches on that door. Sorry, I only see clients by appointment. Oh. It's 50 bucks. I don't kiss and I don't do any weird shit. Fine by me. Put your money on the table. You got exactly 10 minutes when the alarm rings, it's over, okay? Um, are, are we seeing, um, this is awkward. Like the picture on our wall, though, when it turns back round. Yeah, that picture. There they are with the women. I like that. You should take your clothes off. We ain't got all day. Actually, I'm not a customer. Oh, shit, a cop. I should have known. What do you want? A freebie? Is that it? My name is Scott Shelby. I'm a private detective. The families of the victims of the origami killer asked me to investigate the murders. I came here just to ask you some questions about Johnny. I already told the police all I know and I have nothing to add. Leave me alone. Hmm. Be compassionate. I understand, Lauren. I know what you're going through. Oh yeah? You know what it feels like to find your own son's body on a wasteland? I'm sorry, I don't believe you have the slightest idea what I'm going through, Mr. Shelby. Okay, um, let's uh, convince. The killer is walking around free as we speak. He'll kill again if he's not arrested. Hey, Johnny's dead, so what difference does it make? Okay. If we don't find the killer, there'll be other mothers who find their son's body on a deserted wasteland. But, but, but you're right. Why should you care? It's not your problem anymore, right? What do you want to know? Um, uh, Is that it? No more questions? Oh, shit. How did your son disappear? He used to go play with the neighborhood kids after school. It was pouring down something awful that day. I'll never forget it. All his friends came home around five. All except him. Okay, um, suspect? Did you suspect anyone after he disappeared? I meet a lot of pretty shady characters in my line of work. Sure, I thought of it at first. But it didn't seem to make any sense. I don't believe any of my clients could have done that to my Johnny and all those other kids you want one no thanks I quit that's brave
Uh, let's see. Uh, Do you know if they found anything on the wasteland? Any leads or witnesses? No. He said he must have run away and he'd probably end up coming back. His body was found five days later with a origami figure in his hand and an orchid on his chest. Mm, Johnny? Tell me about Johnny. What kind of kid was he? Johnny was really a good boy. Sometimes he fought with other kids who called me a, you know. In his own way, I think he understood what was going on. Mm -hmm. um, she just lost her kid. I can understand how she's feeling. Well, if you remember anything, the smallest detail, give me a call. Okay, um... I should have eased up on her. Looks like she's still in shock. Okay. No point in pushing her. She's not going to tell me anymore. Oh. Don't touch me! Okay. My son was the most precious thing I had. The only good thing in my whole fucking life. He was taken away from me for no reason. Go away. Get out of here! Um, whoops. Okay, uh, let's see. Is there anything else in here? I should be leaving, I know. But, whatever. Can I have a look in your fridge? No? Alright, well, um. I didn't learn squat. Well, worth a try. Tact. Yeah, right. Tact is not my strong suit. Okay, my controller is super squeaky, by the way. I gotta get out of here. Hmm. Fine. Let's, uh, ooh, hang on. Can I get any of this stuff? No? Alright, let's go. Okay. Again? Again? Really? Um, all right. Well, maybe not. I don't know what's wrong with them. Okay. Um. Lauren. Lauren, open up, baby. It's me. Troy, what are you doing here? I already told you I don't want to see you anymore. Sorry, Del. But Who's I really this? Wanted to see ya. Okay, um, hey. Oh, crap. Uh, let's just, um, maybe we should help her. <laughs> what do you want, asshole? Lauren! Um. Is everything alright? She's just swell. Now beat it, loser! Uh, okay, let's, um, not do that. If you're looking for trouble, you found it. I'm gonna beat the shit out of you. Oh. Okay. Oh my God. Oh. Okay. Ah. Okay. We're fine. Okay, let's get that and that. Perfect. Oh my God. He has a chair. Oh Jesus. Oh Jesus. Oh. Okay, circle. Ah, that was the wrong one. Okay, come on. There we go. Oof. A circle. Ah, that was wrong. Shit. Okay. Oh my god. Right, no. Not going well for us. Sorry, and our table just broke. Oh no. Ah. Okay, come on. 
Oh, I'm still like pricing it and I don't need to be. Right. Okay, come on. We got this. I think we are doing better. I mean, we're doing all right for ourselves here. Ah, wrong button. Well, it went well, didn't it? Oh. There we go. I'll see you again, asshole. Will you? Will you really? Are you all right? Better than him, I guess. Who is he? An ex-client who thinks he owns me. He was getting violent, and I told him I didn't want to see him anymore. Well, you should be careful. He'll probably be back. Sorry about the mess. Mr. Shelby? Yeah. Thanks. Oh. Oh, God. Oh. Hey, so we got a bunch of, um, Trophies, so what are we doing here? I don't know what's happening. Tuesday, eight oh five. What's happening? I don't know. I guess we keep changing character. It's kind of interesting though. Um, let's see. The zone is sectioned off, sir. Please step back. Agent Norman Jaden, FBI. You got a badge or something, Mr. Jaden? Yeah. Yeah, of course. Okay, let's just... Check. You can pass. Okay. I'm looking for Lieutenant Blake. Is he around? I saw him arrive earlier. He's here somewhere. Thanks. Goddamn rain. Hasn't stopped pouring since I arrived. I'm really gonna love it here. Reporters. Already. Huh. They seem well informed. Okay. God. My hands are trembling. I gotta keep my act together. At least for now. Hmm. What are those? Video memo recording, Agent 47023, Nam and Jaden, Tuesday, October 4th, 2011. Time is 8.14 a.m. Okay. I guess that shows us the clues. I think we're meant to be looking for somebody though. I'm related to the investigation. I'm looking for Lieutenant Carter Blake. Thanks. All right, cool. Let's go get him. 
Uh, wait, hang on. The crime scene is compromised by all these people. I doubt there'll be many clues left. If there were any to start with. Lieutenant Blake, I'm Agent Norman Jaden from the FBI. I went by your office this morning, they told me you'd be here. Now if you're looking for rain, dead bodies, and highways, you come to the right place. Mike, will you tell that asshole with the bulldozer to stop for five minutes? I can't hear myself think here. Right away, Lieutenant. Well, are you coming, Jaden? So, what happened? Some guy taking his dog for a piss found a body about 6 o'clock this morning. We don't know much more right now. Based on what we've seen, looks like the work of the origami killer. Has the time of death been established? Based on the rigor mortis, must be less than six hours ago. We should know more once the coroner has had a look. Any news on the coroner? He's on his way, Lieutenant. We've been waiting for an hour, for fuck's sake. Has the body okay. been identified? No, not yet. We should know more later today. Any witnesses? None yet. Given the neighborhood, I'd be surprised if anybody saw anything. Hmm. There are a lot of people on the crime scene. Aren't you afraid your men might destroy some clues? You don't find proof sitting behind a desk. We're not in the habit of trampling things into the ground, even if we're not in the FBI. No. No, of course not. That's... That's not what I meant. Tony, oh. I don't want to see a single shit stirring journalist within a mile of here. You got it? Yes, Lieutenant. Uh, Do you have leads? any leads? My men are going over to scene with a fine tooth comb. If the killer left anything behind. We'll find it. The case seems to be attracting the attention of the media. Yeah, a greedy pack of vultures. These guys have killed their mothers for a scoop. Some investigation. It's becoming a three-ring circus. Listen, I, I'm a little busy here. Why don't we discuss all this a little later? Back at the office. Well, no problem. I understand. Do you mind if I have a look around? Be my guest. Hey, Jade. You come and see me if you find anything, okay? We're on the same team now. All right. Well. Let's get our handy dandy glasses back. Alright, let's go. Oh, hang on. Harry come. Sample of no interest. Comes from one of the policemen present on the wasteland. Alright. It's like there's like footprints everywhere. Okay, what is Harry comment, the victim is lying on his back. No visible signs of violence. A small origami figure in the right hand. Fingers were probably closed after the time of death. Mm -hmm. An orchid was placed on the victim's chest. The victim is Jeremy Bowles, declared missing five days ago. See reference file. Superficial wound on the right thigh. Blood analysis suggests it could be post-mortem. Probably a scratch that occurred when the body was being moved. The blood report indicates an advanced and long-lasting state of exhaustion.
His face is covered with mud, like the other victims. Looks like it all, so I guess we'll just go. Cool. Hmm. Alright. Not really seeing anything now. Oh, here's something. Harry comment, sample of no interest. Comes from one of the policemen present on the wasteland. Annoying. Alright, well I guess we'll go this way. Oh, Seems the only traces the killer left are those he intended to leave. He knew exactly what he was doing. Right down to the tiniest detail. Um... There's a railroad track near where the body was left. Same as all the other victims. Okay, so they must get the train then? Oh. Is that cat? Oh no! Dead cat. The FBI doesn't keep files on dead cats. Not yet. Oh. Look, kitty. I don't actually know where I'm going right now. Guess I can't go that way. Let me just like turn myself around. Um. Maybe that's all there is to see, I don't know. Hmm. Guess we can go this way, see if there's anything at the other side of the uh, train. Uh, Way too many people here. They're trampling all over the crime scene. Hmm. Strange character, that Blake. Didn't seem too pleased to see me. Killer must have carried the body here. Gotta be tracks around here somewhere. Oh, I did not see these before. What is this? Harry Connor. There are traces of blood on the fence behind the railroad line. It comes from the victim. The killer came this way with the body and probably grazed it on his way through the fence. Hmm. Okay. Oh. Okay. Oh. Alright, alright, alright. Well, we'll do that again, I guess. I think it was meant to hold that. Okay. Oh wait, that one. Okay. Perfect. A square. X. R1. Left one. Awesome. That one. There you go. I would just slid all the way down there. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Okay, more clues. I want one of these handy dandy things. There's a good chance that they're the killers. Okay. It's fine. Oh, oh. Coming. Tire tracks on the side of the road behind the railroad line. It may be the killer's car. I think I've seen all okay. there is to see. 
I think I've seen enough. Better get back to the station before I catch pneumonia. Alright then. Not perfect. Holy but Jesus. What are you doing? What are you doing? Go down there. <laughs> ah. Oof. Alright. Guess we're going this way. Covered in mud. Lovely jubbly. Maybe we need to speak I'm to you. Back to the office. I'm staying. Uh, no, I've we... seen enough. I'm leaving too. Perfect. Let's go. I'm covered in mud, though. So. We're not thinking anything because I just tried it. What, what we even is it this way? Just thought I'd check. You can never be. Too careful. We just went through your body. That was lovely. Lovely experience that was. Right, let's get to our car, which is over here, I believe. I keep forgetting you can change the camera. Okay. Oops. <laughs> I thought that was for the seatbelt. <clears throat> no! You! Get, get back in there. Alright, let's not do that again then. Okay, let's um do this. Look at the mud on us. Ugh, gross. 